There is a critical responsibility to the owner of the vehicle when he is putting his vehicle onto the road to make sure it is serviceable and to ensure that he has got a driver who is appropriately trained with the requisite documents together with the PSV operator, the Makanga, upon all the paperwork. We have gone around the country, about to the Majinza, we've got another two weeks to go to be able to support and see turning around uh, this uh, uh, sector. We have also partnered with the National Police Service in, uh, in regards to the activities that we are undertaking so that it is coordinated, it is sustainable and to ensure that we all come together as a community and as a country to be able to support. This is not just for purposes of uh, compliance. We started this way before. This is, I think, the second month and we are going for another at least one month uh, to the other part of the country. We started off with training uh, across the country. We started off with um, uh, what was called uh, uh, office training and in regards to the operations that we were undertaking. Now we are now doing the vehicle, so that is where we are here with the owners. And then the next stage is we are working with the police to be able to then support us on the matters related to enforcement. This is an exercise that we are scaling up to go to other parts of the transport sector, not just only the Matatus. We are working with the heavy commercial vehicles and also our school transport. You will be seeing an advertisement uh, out for a new regulatory framework for school transport operators. It will be in the papers on Tuesday, together with heavy commercial vehicle uh, uh, regulations that we are expediting, so that we can also regulate that sector with more detail to take care of the issues that are emerging. Uh, as you are aware, the last time they were done a regulatory review was in 2017. Uh, now we would like to update them to 2024. So we'll be going for public participation across the country, uh, starting from the 15th of April, on matters related on school transport and heavy commercial vehicles, because that's an area of great concern based on the statistics and the accidents we have seen.